Watts, Compton, Carson, Wilmington, Long Beach, Linwood, Gardena, Torrance. We've spent decades experiencing firsthand what happens if you try to stop gun violence with more guns. The answer, people keep getting killed. I grew up in Watts, and while some in Washington treat gun violence as if it's just a political issue, here in our community, it's a terrifying fact of our daily life. Like too many in our district, I've lived through every side of gun violence, witnessed too many senseless deaths, and too many dreams unfulfilled. This is where my friend Jennifer's son, Tavin, was shot and killed just for wearing red tennis shoes. He was just 19 years old, but was killed for wearing red in the wrong neighborhood. When I served as a police officer and put on that uniform every day, I believe I can make a difference. With safer streets and a better relation between police and our community. It's one of the reasons I knew I had to serve. On average, 96 Americans die every day because of guns. The NRA claims that more guns make us safer, but the statistics paint a different picture. They don't. That's why in the State Assembly, I've taken on the gun lobby to keep firearms out of the hands of the wrong people and give our young people an opportunity to succeed. Because as Father Boyle said, nothing stops a bullet like a job. The NRA says they have me in their crosshairs. I say, bring it on.